Hey y'all. So today I got my um my um what is it called? Zavinci, I think. I have to post it in the link. I got my squirrel and animal repellents. That's what you hear popping. So they're solar. So I won't have to worry about batteries. But I'm going to do a quick install with them. Um, right here in front of the corn. So I can kind of keep that little rascal open from eating my corn. If I can help it. So I'm going to think I'm going to stick it right here in this area. Probably have to do it. I wonder what the radius is. Well, I'll come back and let y'all know what I'm doing. All right, so I got that one stationary here down the row of corn. So hopefully it will sense any crazy animals. It's got a red light on it. let you know that it's lit up. I'm supposed to let it charge for at least three hours. I may have to move this into the sun so it'll get at least three hours of sun charge to make sure it works today. All right, so let's go put it down here at the other end of the yard. I think I want to try to protect my tomatoes down here. I've been seeing a lot of little animals running around in this area as well. Now that ground was smooth. So it went right down in. All right, so. Putting it down here where I'll be able to see if anything's missing with my my beef steak tomatoes. As y'all can see, we got a few tomatoes coming on there. So this is the line light. Got some flowers, but we also got some tomatoes coming right here. So these are supposed to be big tomatoes, so I'm going to have to get some more supports in here. But uh, for now, they seem to be coming in just fine. So we shall see. My husband noticed that the rabbits have been hopping around in the sand down here at my fire pit. And I figure what's going on is uh, it rained the other day, so the sand is kind of cool. And he saw a couple of them laying down here uh, in the sand area. Just never know about these crazy animals. Mm -hmm. 